They all lived happily, happily, happily ever after. Can you guess what time it is, guys? Well, hey there, reader friends. I'm Erica, and welcome to my channel. And it is time to announce the challenges, etc., for Fairy Telethon round three. I'm so ready. Fairy Telethon just makes me so happy, guys. It just makes me so happy. This round of Fairy Telethon will run from Sunday, August 11th to Sunday, August 18th, and it'll begin at midnight wherever you are and end at the stroke of 12 midnight when wherever you are. That's right. That's when we all become pumpkins again. Ooh, fall's coming, and I love pumpkin spice. I'm so basic. Fairy Telethon is co-hosted by myself and four other, four other, three other, four, three, four, I can't count today, guys. I can't count your eyes. Becky, Alice, Jordan, Sam. Four, four other cohorts, cohorses, no, co-hosts, amazing ladies. Becky at Coffee, Cocktail, and Books, Sam at A Bear and Bee Books, Jordan at The Lost Reader, and Alex. And this round, Alex will be co-hosting on her blog. She's not going to be doing her um, YouTube channel for this round, and I'll leave a link to her blog down below as well. So let's get into the challenges. I'm so excited. Challenges. Ooh, ooh. Challenge number one, Thumbelina. Read a retelling under 250 pages. Challenge number two, Gentle Giant. Read a retelling over 500 pages. Have fun, guys. Number three, If the Shoe Fits. Read any fairy tale retelling from your TBR. Anyone, any of them, any of them. Number four, Creature of the Deep. Read a book that has sirens, mermaids, or sea monsters, anything like that under the sea, under the ocean, in the deep fathoms below counts. And this doesn't have to be a retelling, it can be an original story. I'm so ready to read about mermaids, guys. Number five, try the gray stuff, it's delicious. Don't believe me, ask the dishes. They can sing, they can dance. After all, miss, this is friends. Read with a yummy treat, any yummy treat. Extra points, although the points don't matter, if you uh, post a picture of your yummy treat. Because I love yummy treats. Mine will probably be ice cream or gelato or something like that. Number six, a whole new world. I'm going to sing all the prompts this time, guys. Read a fairy tale or retelling with a diverse main character. Someone who's not like you. Someone that's different from you. That can be visually, in terms of like how they look. That could be culturally. That could be sexually, like in terms of sexuality anything that's different than yourself. And number seven, Rags to Riches. Read the group book, The Princess and the Fangirl by Ashley Poston. Poston? Poston. Don't know. Don't know. As always, we're pretty lenient about what counts for the books in this readathon. We only require that they be, you know, magical in some element or have that folktelly element to them. One thing that we are being a bit more strict I guess you could say about this time or a bit more direct about is that I'm um, focusing on retellings rather than just original fairy tales but there are some challenges where the original works too like you can read an original that's fine for some of them ultimately we want you guys to have fun if you have any questions you can tag us you can tweet us at fairy tailathon and uh, we will get back to you ASAP because we want to be helpful I myself will be doing some research about the Thumbelina challenge in particular, um, finding some books, and I will maybe make a recommendation video for some of the challenges uh, later in the month. Oh, I should mention that we will be doing prizes again this year. Uh, the first prize is called Outsmart the Sea Witch, which is a $15 gift card to Amazon or Book Depository. And we can do prizes anywhere in the world as long as Amazon or Book Depository ships to your location. And for that one, you need to uh, complete one challenge and read one book. The second challenge is Escape the Kraken. Kraken? Kraken? I'm saying Kraken. Kraken? I don't know how to say it, guys. It's been a long time since I watched that pirate movie. This will be a $30 gift card, and in order to be eligible for this prize, you need to complete all seven challenges and read a minimum of three books. Because, of course, we allow you to double up on challenges. If you have one book that meets multiple challenges, you should read it and it would count completely. But we do require that you read three books because this is the grand prize, guys. It's the grand prize. We will have more information about how to enter into the prize drawing 
thing later so make sure to follow us on our Twitter that's where we're gonna put all the information about that and if you have any questions feel free to leave them down below uh, I would love to know if you're gonna participate with us this round and I will see you next time guys bye